Hey guys and gals, Shadow Dragon here. Welcome back to the Pokemon Y randomized Nuzlocke. I had just walked outside the gym and was greeted with this. Hi, Shadow. I don't know who's talking to me. Oh, it's these two. How's it going? Hey, that's the fairy badge. It's so cute and sparkly. Know what? We're going to go tour the Pokeball factory. Come with us. I'm interested in Pokeballs because they're used to catch Pokemon. To put it another way, I'm utterly fascinated by them. How's it going, everybody? Welcome. I already did this. Last time on the Pokemon Y randomized Nuzlocke, we we got the fairy badge. Wow, apparently I even messed up my own intro, apparently. Um Yeah, let's just go to the Pokeball Factory. <laughs> Shadow's already fucked up enough. Well hey, maybe I'll get a Master Ball. Who knows? Actually I think I do get a Master Ball. Now that I think about it. Uh I'm actually a little positive that I will be getting a Master Ball here, because I think I get given it. Uh, what's going on, guys? Then let us in, and you'll see. I'll go talk to him again. Um, Shauna, wait! Well, it's already playing the dungeon music. Oh, hey, guys! How's it going? Did Shawnee and Trev go running off just now? What's the deal? We were supposed to meet here, too. I wonder what the matter is. Eek! Shawnee, wait, stop! Was that Team Flare? Well, what's going on? Well, I guess I'll go help them. Team Flare? There might be something happening inside. Let's go check it out while the guard is gone. Yeah, that seems like a good idea, actually. Also, giant doors to this Pokeball factory. I love it. Hey, pal! You wanna fight? Can't that idiot outside even handle guard duty? Well, obviously not. So sorry, but we're not offering tours right now. That's a shame. With a red suit like that, you must be a member of Team Flare, right? Did you have to take part in a time job at the Pokeball Factory to pay for that ugly suit? What? How dare you mock Team Flare? Mighty Anna! Get him! I'll take care of this. You go on ahead. Oh, I don't even have to fight the guard for once. Hell yes. Let's go. Ah, shit. I'm a nameless Team Grand Flare Grunt. I have yet to make a name for myself. <laughs> Why are they so stupid? And he's got a machine! <laughs> Well, yeah, I don't th I don't see you making a name for yourself with a bird. Dude, especially when I've got leftovers. How do you expect to go up against that? You just can't. You can't. Stop trying. Get rid of... Maybe evolve your bird. Rule number one. Evolve bird. Rule two. Don't fuck with the kid who has leftovers. <laughs> I'm a nameless crow who lost. I have yet to make a name for myself. Rule three. Maybe go back to school? You don't seem to understand much. Alright, well let's actually go on the conveyor belt, because I just remember this is what I'm supposed to do now. Oh, right, and I could have... yeah. When I beat you, tears will fall from your eyes, like Pokeballs rolling down a conveyor. So beautiful. <laughs> he has such a way with words, but not a way with Pokemon. Why would you send out a Spupa, of all things? I mean, again, though, am I really surprised that nothing can stand up to the might of le- Oh, right, this thing's a bastard. Now you're gonna die. Now I'm making it my sole goal to kill you with flamethrower. Die, Spupus, die! That's what you get. Smart bastard, though, I'll give him that. Anyway, we got Moxie boost. I really wish I could get Dragon Claw soon. That'd be awesome to have for Moxie. No, oh, Borealis kill 41. Hey, wants to learn the move Slash. Uh, nah, nah, I actually like my moves a bit more. I know it has Dragon Rage, but... Actually, I just... Okay, hit B. That's what I want to do. Yes, give up on Slash. I don't want to learn it. A Valabi. Dark Flying. So, yeah, we, we stick with, uh, we stick with, um, Leftovers here. I think Ice Beam will one-shot it. I'm hoping Ice Beam one-shots it, but... Alright, yeah, there we go. That's done. Although we're not getting a lot of experience points, but we're still leveling up our Pokemon, which is great. Team Flare defeated! What do you have to say? Please take me away on the conveyor belt to a world without pain. <laughs> Why are these guys so dramatic right now? It's not like I you know, murdered them or anything. Oh, I can't go on the... Okay, right. Oh, I think I remember how to do this part. I don't, actually. That's a lie. Oh, the item. Oh, I think I messed up how to get that item. 
I definitely messed up how to get that item. Well, we're gonna ignore you for a bit. Da, 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 da. I like how they have some people guarding conveyor belts and others people guarding, you know, the obvious entry points. And somebody did not forget to pick up the full incense. That seems like a problem, but not my fault. Okay, uh, yeah, up the stairs. <laughs> Past the guy. Oh, I see now. Yeah, we gotta find... Oh, right. Yeah, because now this one will reverse it. Which, I kind of want to get that item first. Can I get... Wait, what's in here? Hello! I've come to save y'all. Do you have anything to give me? Both of you and your Pokemon should take a... Perfect. I'm just thinking I was tired. Don't push yourself, yeah. You're not wearing a red suit, so you're not a member of Team Flair. Who are you? Doesn't matter. Anyway, be Team Flair. <laughs> Pokemon stole my team player. We can't become friends with Pokemon. We, we automated the factory to lighten the burden on Pokemon, but it also means there are fewer people, so the factory is taken over almost instantly. <laughs> All right. I like to imagine, like, Team Flare planning this entire, like, uh, siege. All right, it's a big factory. Obviously, they're going to have a lot of people running it. Also, I'm going to grab this item real quick while I explain this. Uh, they're going to have a lot of people running it. <laughs> so we're going to bring in an army of people to make sure they get there. Hi, I'm the director. I'm here to give a tour. How many of you are there at this factory? Only three. We don't need any more. Oh, this will be easy then. <laughs> What'll be easy? Why do you have 20 peep? Oh, no. <laughs> and it's immediately just <laughs> freaking just kicked to the ground. <laughs> Even with a guy with a Pidgey actually did something. <laughs> All right, let's actually go and change the conveyor belt because I think that's what they're uh, they were telling us to do. Yeah, use this to switch the conveyor belt. And then, yeah, now we can go here. Right, because now that we're here, we can... Yeah, we're just going to ignore you. Don't worry about us. And ignore you. Anyway, let's go see. There's another compartment here. Hey, guys. Come now, work for Team Flare. If you just help out, we wouldn't have to carry all these Pokeballs by ourselves. Or with a contribution of just five million Poke Dollars, you could become a- I'm sorry! Are you charging people to join your organization? That is the smartest thing I've ever seen. But no wonder you have all the dumbasses. It's a no-brainer. What in the world are you Team Flare Fools thinking? I'll never forgive any group that tries to take all the Pokeballs for itself. Forget it, quit wasting your time with this person. I agree. There's no one we can use here, let's just blow this place to smithereens! Jesus! <laughs> Oh, what do you have here, an intruder? You're one to talk. You, please help me. Oh my, oh my, getting a little desperate, are we, Mr. Company President? I guess I'll just have to extinguish your little glimmer of hope. Alright, nameless admin. Yeah, you guys were on- Oh, we're cool lava! I don't have a water-type move on leftovers to fully deal with that. Oh, whatever will I do? I know! Kill it! <laughs> with Slash! We're still ten levels higher than it! Okay, that's a problem. Now it's starting to get a boost. It actually got an attack off, guys. I wasn't expecting this thing to actually hit me back. And it's dead now. <laughs> Where was the critical hit earlier? Leftovers, come on. Boost to Moxie. I really wish I had other physical moves. I might need to, like, revamp this one. Diglett. Diglett. Just out of all the things you could have sent at me, Diglett was your best idea. A Diglett. I'm starting to think that they only got this factory because they had numbers, not because of the strength of their Pokemon. <laughs> he looked the what? what? Just looks depressed. Anyways, take your money from you. Come on, you didn't have to go off for a pitiful president like him. So lame. That's just embarrassing from an admin. Still, no worries. We're on it. This pair of scientists will clean up after you. Let's take him on two versus one. We must improve our chances of winning. Hey, Serena. We'll see about that. Sorry I'm late. There's another one? One kid or two. It doesn't make a lot of difference. When we're the ones fighting together, our odds of victory increase exponentially. You might want to check your numbers. Are you really even scientists? Can you help me fight them, neighbor? I want to say no. But I don't think Leftovers got any workout, so... Let's go. <laughs> Team Flare, Celosia, and Brioni. These ones actually have names. Galate and Radicate! Okay. The Gallade actually scares me. Eradicate not so much, but the Gallade. 
You have a pan sage. You have a pan sage. You have a pan sage. Why are you using a pan sage against these two? I need to take out that Gallade. Okay, that was the critical hit. That's a problem. Okay, thank God they attacked the monkey. But that means the Gallade's gonna hit me with whatever it's about to hit me with. And I know that thing's probably gonna have a fighting type. You psycho cut? Oh good, you're actually being smart, sending out your Mew next. Very happy about that. I'm sorry, the Gallade just used Helping Hand on the Raticate. Out of all the moves it could have used, it used the Helping Hand on the Raticate. I... Okay. I'm baffled. I thought you were supposed to be smart. Oh, that's gonna hurt. No, that's gonna hurt! Okay. Kills the... <laughs> Helping Hand actually was kind of the right play there, apparently. Because it could have killed Leftovers. But Leftovers is still strong. Still has not learned Dragon Claw yet. If I could hit to learn Dragon Claw, it'd be awesome. <laughs> no way! Wow, we are lame. Probability is just probability, after all. Absolutes do not exist. <laughs> we have the same fucking... Like, yeah! Oh my, oh my. So lame, what a shame. We got beat. Enough already. We've already stolen the Pokeballs, Great Balls, and Ultra Balls. Let's call it good and leave. Thank you! <laughs> you saved us, thank you so much. You're astounding Pokemon trainers for being so young. Well, I want to show my appreciation. I'll give you a Master Ball or a Big Number. I think you should pick first. I'm taking the Master Ball! I'm sorry! Yeah, I like money, but a Master Ball is a <laughs> As a bonus, you can have the one you didn't pick as well. You're not cool, man. And one for you too. It seems like a lot. I just have a feeling you two will put them to great use. You're different for those team player people. Oh, I don't know the proper way to use a big number. <laughs> it's the last two team player. What are they planning to accomplish by taking all the Pokeballs for themselves? That is a weird thing to s do. Uh, who? I really want to know who, like, came up with the idea of stealing the Pokeballs. Because when you think about it, that's not exactly... I mean, like, if there were Pokemon in them, yeah, but... Hey, guys! Think it's okay to have to go have a go around now? <laughs> I'm sorry, Team Flare messed up everything up. It's not a good time right now. Team Flare, have I heard that name somewhere? Would they be the people in the red suits from a minute ago? That's right, Trevor. Team Flare... They took all the Pokeballs by force, but they're for everybody to use. How awful. It seems like we, it would be best not to get involved with those guys. You're right, Trev. Team Flare sure is terrible. What should we do now? According to the town map, Dendamil Town is next. Wow. Or Shadow, you and Serena are really awesome. You're way stronger than those bad guys. Still, try to do anything crazy, okay? See ya! Thank you. Everyone's okay, thanks to you. But if I keep relying on you like this, going on this journey will lose its meaning. Get a hat! It helps me! Hollow clip received. Uh oh. Oh. We're bringing you a special bulletin. The Pokeball factory in the area around Lavera City has been attacked. The identities of those involved are unknown. However, this is not expected to have any effect on the sales of Pokeballs. Thank you! Oh, good. I needed those. I'm just saying, I need to get my next encounter on the way to Dendamil Town. Anyway, I think now actually that we have six gym badges. What are you still doing it? Those red suits are hard to run in. I'll never catch up with those kids. But they haven't struggled to be grumpy about this. Dude, I think the admins are a little bit more, you know. <laughs> no, the admins are gonna be pissed at you. What am I saying? You let. Not only did you let three kids get away, the two kids that you left. or that got in because you left your post ended up kicking the admin's ass. You're gonna be like. The guy with the Pidgey's gonna get promoted above you. And he can't even- he had a Pidgey! I- <laughs> Alright, but now that I have six gym badges, I think- yeah, I can buy Ultra Balls. I already have 20 of one of them. I appear to have forgotten what I, uh, have bought in. I didn't mean for that to rhyme. Let's go to the next town! That's- or the next route, at least. Which I believe is through here. Route 15. The Brunway. And, like every new route, we have a new encounter! Snubble. Snubble. Why is it that I now have Pokeballs that I can actually use 
Seriously, I have a Master Ball. I have greater Pokeballs, and you're giving me a Snubble. Snubble, of all things. You gave me a Latios after the second gym that I couldn't catch. Or was it, it was one of the two, Latios or Latios. And you're handing me a Snubble? I'm naming it Bubble. I don't think I'm going to use Bubble. We, we have a good team already. Our team is pretty much stacked. Uh, let's see, any items down here real quick? What the fuck? I don't even know if I'm here. I am. You actually did. I was not expecting you. What do you have? Cubone. You have a Cubone. You surprised me. You could have had amazing teams. You surprised me. And yet you pull out a Cubone. A Cubone. Really? A Cu. I'm. Um... I'll see you guys. If anything interesting happens on the route, or when I get to the end of the route. I'm assuming this is an item. Aha, it is! I was like, there's no trainer here. I got a fluffy tail! I don't know what a fluffy tail does, but I have it now. Oh, hollow clipped received, all right. This is new. Oh, you're not you again. Lysander, according to Professor Sycamore's research, Mega Evolution releases all of the Pokemon's hidden energy at once. The Pokemon then exhibits a level of power it cannot attain through ordinary evolution. What meaning can we draw from this? Do all people and Pokemon have such potential, or is it hidden within a chosen few? Why did you- Why do you- Why do you have my number, old man? Alright, so it turns out... Uh, I might be able to get another encounter, as this is Route 16 here. This is either an item or... I can get an encounter here. Alright. There's a person there. But yeah, I know, we can get an encounter here. Wait, what's this? Lost Hotel? I guess it's another encounter! It's a fish! It's another fish. I'm not really inclined to catch it, though. Uh, fast killing. If you survive an ice beam, I'll catch you. You know what? I, I did say I'd try to catch it. I'm gonna keep my word because I thought I was about to die. But I really doubt that, you know, that it's not gonna go into Ultra Ball at Red Hell. I'd be surprised if it didn't. Color me surprised. You must... This fish is gonna kill itself. This fish is gonna kill itself. In my hubris, this fish is gonna kill itself. Masculine, if you don't want to die, get in the bag. I think the, the fish... I... What did it just use on me? I was clicking too fast. But I, I, maybe the maybe Masculine does want to get in the bag then? I don't know. Maybe not. I, I think it's just toying with me at this point. Yeah, and it got a crit and killed itself. All right. Well, I came down to the Lost Hotel. Kind of leaving disappointed, really. Kind of hilarious, though, that I didn't know I could get two more encounters here. Uh, real quick, though, I'm gonna heal up uh, Leftovers, as Leftovers has taken a bit of damage. There we go. And because we have another encounter coming up, let's send out Buggert. I say Buggert should be able to do some damage without actually killing the thing, hopefully. And I'm really curious as to what I could get in here. This is a new encounter. It's viable. Might be better. That's such a good Pokemon, actually. Like, straight up, we're going to false swipe this. We're going to try and catch this thing. And it has sweet scent, so I couldn't do my next strategy, which was to double team. <laughs> Thankfully, I think all it has are grass and poison moves. Which, Buggert will four times resist any grass move. Amazing, really. One more false swipe, and as long as the thing doesn't have, like, pedal dance, we'll be fine. Alright, I, I think we can catch this thing. I might actually use this on the team. Granted, the team's pretty much just leftovers in his five backups. <laughs> It's, it's, got, it's, it's Chef Leftovers and his five sous chefs. And we just got 
another sous chef, I guess. I'm naming this one Ghost. No real reason why. Kind of just want to. That being said, now that we've completed this, Dendemil Town should be right up here, I believe. Yeah, Route 15 to Brunway. And this should lead us to our next city, Dendemil Town. Ooh, yeah. Well, hello, Shadow Dragon. Who's challenging me? Oh, Professor! How have you been? How's your journey going? You see, when I was younger, I visited many different regions as well. I met many kinds of Pokemon and noticed how each place has its own distinct flavors. So I really came to enjoy trying new foods as I traveled. Because of my adventures, I'm an expert in all the cafes all over Kalos. Um, Professor? Come now, Dexio. I'm going somewhere with this. Do you remember the Pokemon Lysander mentioned at that cafe? Yes. Wonderful, I knew you would. Kalos' legendary Pokemon is called... Weveltal! According to material I've read, those who saw it were so overwhelmed by its power, they were only able to say that this Pokemon resembled the letter Y. Apparently, this Pokemon will absorb energy. Its lifespan is said to be a thousand years. When it reaches the end of its life, it steals all of the spirits around it. Wherever do you think a Pokemon that amazing could be now? When Kalos' legendary Pokemon loses all of its vitality, it goes to sleep in a secret place. I don't have a clue where it could be. The writings that mention it also are also around a thousand years old, so they aren't much help. It would be absolutely astounding if you found it, Shadow Dragon. Maybe I'll look into the legend a little bit. If I find something, I'll let you know. Ha <laughs> Oh, it would be a thrill if you found it indeed. But your journey is yours and your Pokemon's alone. I want you to enjoy yourself and do whatever you'd like. Okay, I'm gonna go battle the gym leader now. Oh, hi, Trevor. Um, is Professor gone already? I was hoping to have him look at my Pokedex in person. Oh, well, I can still get my Pokedex evaluated at a Pokemon Center's PC. Anyway, I'm heading off to go look at the Pokemon for Pokemon in the Frost Cavern and fill up more of my Pokedex. Okay, I'm gonna go challenge the gym leader now. Once I find the Pokemon Center, because kind of really need to find the Pokemon Center. Where is it? I think that's not where I want to go. Uh, the camera's... Right, now that I think about it, Dendemil Town doesn't have a gym town, does it? No. I'm thinking of the next city over. Hold up. Right, Dendemil Town does not have one. It's Anastar City. Dendemil Town is right under the Frost Cavern. Yeah, so it's Dendemil Town, and then I want to say Snowbell City are the last two places that I'll be getting gym badges at. Don't know how I could forget that. Then there's Killode City, which I don't really think it needs to matter, because yeah, Pokemon League is the final standpoint of this challenge. Right, and yeah, I forgot, Route 16 leads back to Lumio City. Huh. Neat. Alright. Well, then, let's... I guess let's go get a, uh... Well, let's go find the Pokemon Center first. Because there's gotta be one here somewhere. It's... Where is the Pokemon Center? Is it down here? Well, it's an item. King's Rock! Okay! That's the second one I have. Not what I need. I... Where is the Pokemon Center? It's gotta be around here somewhere. Is it down here? There it is. I say, actually, do you give me a TM? Welcome. Moo Moo Milk is just 500. I'm taking a dozen Moo Moo Milk. Thank you for the Moo Moo Milks. That's awesome. Thank you. Thank you for the Moo Moo Milks. Okay, so there's no second trainer here. I want to heal my Pokemon a little bit. And a, or not trainer, but second uh, shopkeep. I wanted to see if there's a second shopkeep here so that I may hopefully get some stuff. From it, maybe a metal coat? I would love a metal coat, honestly. Um But yeah, let's uh let's head up to the Frost Cavern then. Let's maybe we can get another Pokemon to add to the team. Frost Cavern. Um I'm gonna ignore a lot of the trainers here if I can. Memoswine! Is something wrong in the Frost Cavern, Memoswine? Swee Swee! Or Swi Swi, I don't know. Are you headed to the Frost Cavern, trainer? The Memoswine here usually can't get enough of giving people rides Route 17, but these days it seems to be too worried about something in the Frost Cavern to give rides. The Memoswine is a Pokemon that loves cold climates. Maybe it said something amiss in the Frost Cavern. Hey, Trevor. And you are? Oh, my name is Trevor. I'm researching the distribution of Pokemon in the Kalos region at Professor Sycamore's request. I see, so that's why you're walking clear out to the Frost Cavern, then. Memoswine seems concerned about something over there, so be careful. I will, thank you. What are you going to do, Shadow? I'm going to prepare for my expedition. I'm going up to the Frost Cavern. Not because I'm going to help the, the Pokemon, but because... Okay, let's be honest. I'm going to help the Pokemon, but I, I want to get my own Pokemon. I want my own Mamoswine. 
I like how they have signs here, too. Well, let's try and get a encounter here, please. Maybe? We can slide on the stuff here. Can I get an encounter here? Or is it... Do I have to wait? No, this has to be it, right? I'm not using a repel or anything. Ah, shit. Oh, of course, there's ace trainers in here. Three Pokemon? That's the most of all the Pokemon trainers I've seen. But he has a giraffe rig, so... I had buggered out front. That's a... Actually... That thing's level 42? That's a problem for me. I don't know. I'm actually gonna start using other members of my team now. I don't think I can just survive off of leftovers alone. Although, it would still be kind of hilarious if I did. Okay, Fuchiana. No, we can we can take Fuchiana. Come on, man. I you just sent... I just sent out... You just... Uh, you sent out a psychic type to my bug type. Now you're sending out a dark type to my bug type. Next up, you're gonna send out a grass type to my bug type. Do you see how this doesn't make sense for you? I hate that I was right. Leftovers, go get them. I really hate that I was right. I wasn't expecting this guy to actually have a grass type. Although it's kind of funny that I called it. But yeah, let's... Now the trainer's Pokemon are starting to get, like, on par with ours. That's kind of cool. Although, nothing stands up to leftovers. You just really can't. It's leftovers. He's too powerful. He's too powerful. Too powerful, my leftovers. Ha ha ha. Aquatail. No, I like my moves on Joker. And Borealis, level 43. Alright, Neil, get out of here. Bastard man. In the way of me trying to get a Pokemon. Although, I don't know. Can I not get a Pokemon here? I could have sworn there were spawns in here. Like, this seems like a place that would have Pokemon spawns. Well, let's make it to the end of the cavern by doing this, you know, sick ice puzzle that they have. And you don't have to battle this guy, too. <sighs> There's a lot of battling here. It sucks. Sends an Alexio! I forgot to switch out a bugger! Why? Do I keep forgetting to do that? Bugger's not the Pokemon for this. No, send out Barney. Send out Barney. Barney can take the hit. Bugger is weak to any electric type moves this thing may have. I'm not losing my starter, damn it. I refuse. Oh, that's a problem. That's a big problem, because if I don't hit it, it can actually kill me. I think we can hit it, though. I believe in Barney. I believe in you, Barney. Barney, I knew I was right to believe in you. Let's go, Barney. Hell yeah. Level 45. What's the next Pokemon? Goldeen. I don't believe in you that much, though. We're gonna send out Fungil. Does... Does Fungil have any grass-type moves, actually? Mega Drain. I'm gonna send in... Leftovers. <laughs> Oops, hit my desk. Sorry about that. Uh, if I had... If I had, um, Seed Bomb on Breloom, though, I'd run that, but that's... That's just... It's not good as a grass type. I need to... I should have put the Roserade on my team. That's what I should have done. What did it just do to me? The waterfall. It did... Some damage. It did an amount of damage. 12 damage. That's what it did. Sorry, I was doing the math in my head. I hated that I had to do the math in my head. It's bad. I've been defeated! Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Just get out of my way. You're preventing me from catching Pokemon. Or I'm going to assume this is... All for an item. Of course it was. How stupid could I have? You know, I'm... I'm, I am angry. <laughs> Did not want item. Wanted progress. That is what I wanted. I battled these trainers for nothing. For nothing, I tell you. What the hell? Where the hell am I at? I found a ground gem. Where do I go here? Why am I so- this is an optional place. I don't think I, like, have to come here. So why in the- Wait. No, oh, is it this way? No, what? Oh! Okay! Alright! Got an electric. I'm a little confused, not gonna lie. Uh, 
I went through that entire place right before I leave to catch a get a Pokemon. This thing is discharged. Oh god. We are Pokemoning into Barney now. <laughs> I should not have risked Buggert to catch the level 40 electric. That was my fault. But this is a decent electric type. The only problem is this Pokemon, its ability is normally levitate, which you can use it to send out against ground types. This one's probably not going to have levitate, meaning it's gonna have its, you know, its weakness, which, I mean, it's not like the worst thing that an electric could have, but I mean, let, let's see what its summary is. Like, its summary could really, really fuck it up. Welcome to the, the world, Ely. I'm clever. <laughs> I'm not. I decided to head back to the Pokemon Center real quick because of the two new Pokemon that we got, we might replace a couple members of the team. So, whoa, wait a minute. Flare boost? Hang on, I gotta see what this does. Powers up special attacks when the Pokemon is burned. Flare or flame orb on this thing would be amazing because it's a special attacker. That's insane. All right, and then Mega Launcher powers up aura and pulse moves. Getting the Clauncher one is not bad, not bad at all. Although your nature is a little lacking. I much prefer the Roserade of both. But still, honestly, not a bad like that's. Yeah, I'd have to be burned to make use of it, but. Simple, the Pokemon is prone to wild stat changes. Ugh. And then, Sheer Force. I, I haven't checked like any of these. Rockhead, Simple again, Sand, okay, so yeah. Not a lot of, uh... Ghost is probably the best bet here because that's a way better grass type, especially if we can boost its special attack when it's burned. That's insanely, that's insanely useful. So I think, yeah, I think I wanna, I wanna move it on the team. Sorry, sorry, uh, Bungil, but you just, you're not cutting it, honestly. Like, we have way better Pokemon on the team, but we need a better grass type. And with that, everybody, that's all the time I've got for today. So while I healed my Pokemon, thank you, everybody, so much for watching. Next time, we'll continue on with the story. Maybe go back to the Frost Cavern. I feel like there's something that can be done there, and I feel like I've missed it, but I also feel like... I haven't, if that makes any sense. I don't know why. It's very strange. But, uh, yeah. Next time, we're going to continue on to Anastar City and get the next gym badge. See you guys then.